you might not even know, and the person standing next to you could save your life. Today's video is about those strangers who pass us by but hold the highest moral spirit. From helping out cops in catching a pesky criminal to taking the matter into their own hands, these good Samaritans rose as superheroes. They will make you believe in humanity. So sit back and stay tuned. We have a lot in store for you. Let's get started. Number one, the man who chased down a criminal. What you see here is the dark wave of realization hitting this man that he had taken someone's life while driving drunk. But then, something snapped inside him, and he decided to make a run for it. The Good Samaritan, who had his eyes set on him, wasn't going to let him escape his karma like this. He raced after the driver at full speed, tracking him a few miles down and forcing him to stay put on the ground. The driver tried to move, but the man had a good hold on him and kept him pinned to the ground using his knee. He also kept reminding the driver what he did while attempting to stop him from fleeing again. Number two, the couple who stopped the robbers. A neighborhood was ambushed by a gang of robbers, but this couple had enough of the thefts. They were ready to hand them their arrest the next time they came. Two nights ago, these burglars raided cars in the area to hunt for hidden Christmas gifts. They left with a huge pile that day, but their greed didn't end there. They came again and tracked down a car to steal gifts from. This time, the couple was armed and ready to take down the suspects. The man raised his gun as soon as he saw the burglar running. He yelled at him to stop. When the robber didn't listen, the couple raced at full speed after him. The woman pinned the thug on the floor while the man had his gun pointed at him to stop him from fleeing. The couple called the cops, who arrested him right away. Number three, the man who stopped a kidnapping attempt. A couple of caretakers were walking a baby in the stroller. They were near the parking space when an aggressive woman surprised them with an attack. She started screaming loudly that it was her baby, sending the caretakers running in the opposite direction. The owner of the store saw the whole fiasco brewing and his instincts kicked. When the caretakers bolted, leaving the baby behind, he jumped in to keep guard of the stroller. He stood in front of the baby while the woman circled around them. She tried multiple times to sneak off the stroller, but the man stood his ground and forced the aggressor to walk away. Seeing that her attempts were futile, the woman then jumped off onto the traffic lane, never to be seen again. Number four, passerby. Lends a hand in arrest, a traffic stop was pulled on a criminal, but it soon escalated into a car chase. The cop managed to track the criminal down and forced him to the ground. But there was a little twist. The arrest was not coming that easily with the criminal wrestling the cop and trying to rob the gun fitted in his holster. A bystander saw the struggle and decided to intervene. He held the criminal while the cop detained him. The suspect was taken away in custody. Number five, the man who stopped the car chase. A robber was on the loose, going at 80 miles per hour in a stolen vehicle. The police were trailing closely behind, but it didn't look like they had a good edge over the crook. The thief kept finding small gaps in the running traffic and sneaking away from there at high speeds. Suddenly, the car got stuck. A truck had driven straight in front of the stolen vehicle, blocking him in and stopping the robber from fleeing the scene. The crook panicked and tried his best to back up and make space for the run. But his feeble attempts were nothing compared to the driving skills of the trucker. The Good Samaritan jammed in his truck further to halt the car in its place. The cops had him cornered. What's funny is that he tried fleeing by flipping out of the car but ended up getting stuck in the window. Number six, the man who wrestled with the assaulter. A young man came down to this restaurant, saw an old man and thought it would be a good idea to punch him. He stole the old man's things and walked off. The owner saw this happening and lost control of his anger. He chased the suspect down, wrestling him to the ground. Meanwhile, 
the owner's wife arrived at the scene to pick up all the stolen goods the robber had picked up. She then stood on the legs of the suspect to stop him from fleeing while the owner had him pinned to the ground. The robber stood no chance against the fiery couple. Number seven, bystander punches a robber. A robbery attempt turned into a high-speed car chase and it had its own twists. The cops were on the crook's tail when he decided to ditch his vehicle. He stopped midway on the road and tried to get inside another car a few feet away from him. The car had a disabled father and a son inside. They had pulled over when they heard the news of the car chase and were hoping to record it. But they got pulled into the worst scenario possible. The robber tried to wrestle his way inside the car, but the son was quick on his feet. He grabbed the thug and punched him hard in the face. He fell over, and the cops had just arrived in time then to greet him with a quick arrest. Number 8. Stranger Protects Woman A weird guy had walked in the subway with a knife in his hands. He went after a woman, waited for the right opportunity, and violently leapt at her. The woman was pushed to the ground with the strange man on top of her. A passerby saw the assault happening and didn't think twice before jumping in. He shoved the assaulter off the woman and forced his face to hit the floor. He did that on purpose so the crook won't attack him with the knife. Another bystander joined in and grabbed the legs of the crook to keep him at bay. Soon enough, the cops came and took the thug into custody. Number nine, two women saved from an assaulter. A couple of women were walking down the sidewalk when a frustrated man decided to show his true colors. He smacked both the elderly ladies in their heads one by one to the point that they fell to the ground. The man started walking away, but it wasn't going to be that easy to flee. A homeless man hopped in on the action to stop the assaulter from escaping. He raced after him and started a brawl until the violent man was dragged to the ground. He kept him there until the cops arrived to send the criminal to jail. Number 10, the man with the super cane. A crook was on the run with cops trailing behind him. But he was not about to get far. This man with a cane swooped in just in time to catch the robber off guard, dropping him face flat on the ground. The cops raced to the scene to arrest him right there and then. Number 11, robber fired at by a passerby. A restaurant was invaded by a masked man who was hoping to steal a good stash of money at night. The robber darted towards the drive through and threw a bag at the employee. He raised his gun at her and demanded that she fill up the bag. As the visibly scared woman started putting the cash inside the bag, something unexpected happened. A bullet flew through the counter and smashed a glass to the ground. The robber got all panicky and bolted from the scene. Two more gunshots were fired at the robber and one of them connected with his back. A car with one man and two women was a few feet away ordering food when the robber showed himself at the counter. They were not with the crook and must have hit him to stop the robbery attempt. Number 12. Father saves her daughter from a predator. A predator had talked up with a little girl on her phone, trying to set up a meeting. The girl's father saw the conversation and knew he had to do something to catch the vile man. He set up a tent inside his house in the backyard and told the predator to meet him back there. The girl's stepmother was inside the tent, ready to take him down if the need arose. When the man came, he was greeted by an angry father and displeased brothers who wrestled him to the ground. All the men had the predator locked in with his hands tied and feet locked in tape. The man couldn't move. He claimed that he was just meeting the girl to talk. The cops didn't bat an eye to the obvious lie and gave the criminal what he deserved, a trip to jail. Number 13, criminal hits an offender. A man whose behavior was reprehensible to a young girl was escorted by the police officers. He had reportedly forced a four-year-old girl into a physical relationship. Another nearby criminal couldn't see the offender's face without disgust reaching his throat. 
he plunged at the offender, smacking him in his head and then walking away. The cops intervened, but his statement was clear. Number 14. Man chased down an offender. This criminal was being chased down by a group of young boys. They had seen him engaging in forced inappropriate activities with a woman. The group caught him in the act and darted after the criminal until they had him cornered at the gas station. Just then, a police car had dropped by and the cops took the criminal under arrest when they figured out what happened. Number 15. The boxer who smacked the thug. A robber was trying to intimidate the customers in a store. Unluckily for him, a boxer was out for shopping in the next aisle. He jumped up at the opportunity and smacked the thief right in his face. The duo wrestled for a few seconds, but the thug didn't have anything on the boxer. He was brought to his knees and taken away by the cops for a trip to jail. Number 16. People who helped out the cop in trouble. A female cop had pulled a traffic stop on this old man. During the interrogation, he got out of the car claiming that he wanted to get his license out of the back seat. The cop told him to go on the sidewalk. That's when things started getting out of hand. The cop demanded that he sit down, but he just yelled back in response, saying that he wasn't going to comply. The woman repeated a few times, but the man kept arguing and shouting verbal curses at her. That was it for the old man. The cop told him to turn around so she could arrest him, but the old man was not willing to listen. He pinned her to the car and started wrestling with her. A couple of cars parked on the other side of the street to see what was happening. A stranger walked out and darted towards the female cop. He shoved the old man and pinned him to the ground. A couple of other people joined in. Some held his legs while others grabbed his arms. The good people allowed the cops to arrest him. The backup units were called in and the man was detained in handcuffs. Number 17. The man who fired at the robber. This group of men was startled when they heard a shooting outside. One of them ran out of the store with the gun blazing in his hands. He ran for a few blocks and saw the armed gunman coming from the front. He hid himself behind a corner, stealing a few glances to ready his target. Then, with a good aim, he fired at the suspect and managed to take him down. The sad part is that the cops confused him for the suspect and fired at him too. He was found unconscious on the spot. Number 18. Bystanders help arrest a crook. This man was being arrested by the deputy, but it didn't look like the cop had it all handled. He wrestled the man on the ground, but the struggle was still on. The crook refused to stay put and even attempted to grab the gun from the deputy's belt. The bystanders saw the struggle and came to help the deputy out. They pinned the crook down while one of them snatched the gun away from the crook. The cop managed to detain the bad guy. Number 19. The group who saved the cop. A trooper had pulled a traffic stop on a man when things started going in the wrong direction. The suspect charged at the trooper and pinned him to the ground. The cop was struggling to get the suspect off of him when a passerby saw the troubling interaction happening before him. Without any hesitation, he plunged at the suspect and held him down until the cop was back up on his feet. The cop took charge and detained the suspect while the Good Samaritan helped him with the arrest. Number 20. Bus driver chases the thief. A woman had partnered up with a thief on the outside. She went in on the bus, stole a few goods, and handed them out to the man waiting at the door. The bus driver saw the exchange. He leapt to his feet and charged at the criminal. Another bystander had joined in on the chase and they both carried the crook to the cops. Number 21. Man catches the purse snatcher. A bad guy had snatched a purse from an elderly woman at a supermarket. After the steal, he bolted out of the front door, having no clue someone was trailing behind him. A man was on his feet, running after the thug at full speed. He grabbed the crook, forced him down on the ground, and kept him contained 
until the cops arrived at the scene. Number 22. Driver saves old couple from a robber. A man was on his way when he saw something pretty disturbing happening at the corner of the street. The dashcam footage shows a bulky guy trying to snatch the gold chain off of the old man in a wheelchair. The driver yelled out, and the robber got scared. He handed the chain back to the old man and fled the scene in his white car. Number 23. The double save by the bystanders. This bad guy was in the hopes of stealing a car, and he was willing to do anything to go about his way. He pretended that he needed a ride in front of this woman, so she decided to help him. Once she turned her back to the mugger, he charged at her from behind and wrestled her to the ground. A man saw the troubling situation and jumped in to kick the crook off of the woman. But he stepped back as soon as he engaged in the brawl, scared that the robber might hit him. The crook knew it was in his best interest to leave, but he didn't stop there. He ran for a few miles and came to a gas station. He saw a man filling the gas tank on his trunk and saw the opportunity to steal. But the owner was smart. He knew his car was being hijacked and went in after the carjacker. A passerby saw the chaotic scene unfolding before him and jumped in from the passenger seat. The robber rammed hard on the gas, throwing the Samaritan off. He drove in circles until finally crashing into a wall. When the Samaritan saw the thug fleeing the scene, he bolted after the bad guy and tracked him down with the help of the truck owner. They handed the pesky robber to the cops. Number 24. Bystanders rescue a car from being stolen. A woman was jogging down to her car, having no clue that she had attracted a carjacker. She moved into the driver's seat, and the bad guy hopped in after her. He tried very hard to push her on the passenger seat, but the woman stood her ground. She tried to throw him off, created a commotion, and called the Good Samaritans to the scene. They came rushing towards the car, wrestling the man away from the woman. Somehow, the suspect escaped, but the car was rescued from being stolen. Number 25. Guy shoves a thug. This crook was walking around the streets wielding his firearms and scaring away the people around the block. The cops were on his tail when a person saw the crook running towards him. He stood in between the bad guy and shoved him hard on the fence beside him. The crook started running, but the man plunged after him, grasped his clothes, and threw him into the arms of the cops. He then walked off quite casually, away from the scene. Number 26. Group of Witnesses. Contain a drunk driver. This man had been involved in a drunk car crash. He was walking off from the site when a group of witnesses raced to hold him down. The suspect attempted to walk to the convenience store nearby to buy a can of beer, which he took a sip as he was surrounded by the witnesses. Disoriented, he tried to flee again, but the people held him down on the ground. The guy had stolen a vehicle and then crashed it while driving drunk. The cops came and took him into custody. Number 27. Men help out. Two female cops. This crook was charged with assault on a transit officer, so two female cops came down to arrest him. But the man was not giving in. He started fighting with the cops and threw both of them on the ground. He even tried to grab the guns from the cops, but a few good men were standing nearby. When the passers-by saw the fiasco unfolding, they jumped in to help. A few of them got the perp away from the cops and held him in place until the women were back on their feet. The cops took him away in custody. Number 28. Man protects a teenager. This young boy was being chased by a group of teenagers who didn't look like they had the best intentions. The man popped in between the boys and sent them running in the opposite direction. Video later revealed that one of the boys had a gun and his finger was on the trigger while he was chasing the young teenager. Number 29. Store owner saves woman from attempted kidnapping. This guy had kidnapped this young woman and was taking her to different ATMs to steal her money. 
but the store owner thought he was being suspicious when the duo came to the counter. So he went after the two after they were done shopping and stood behind the woman and the man. He told the woman to stay put and blocked the kidnapper's way into the store. Although the man was armed, he didn't strike back and fled the scene in his car. Number 30. Woman saves a baby. This woman was on her way to work when she saw a family in the most disturbed of states. The man was trying to push the baby off the bridge while his partner stood nearby. The woman got out of her car and intervened in the fiasco. She jumped in to grab the baby, but the man was not willing to let go. During the struggle, the man's partner took out the gun from his back pocket and hid it away. Reports claim that the man was threatening both his partner and the baby. Soon enough, the woman managed to grab a hold of the baby, securing her in her arms. Just then, the cops dropped by and arrested the man right there and then. That's all on the bystanders who threatened their own lives to save other people. Humanity still exists and you can count on it. Which one was your favorite encounter? Let us know in the comments below. We would love to hear your thoughts. If you liked the video, leave a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We will be coming up with more videos soon. Until then, goodbye and thanks for watching.